to detect drivers who run. We were surprised to a man to find the victim of this accident still alive in his car. The first call was received at 11 past two and from then on Stradbroke Road was blocked as police, firemen and ambulancemen swarmed around the mangled vehicle. It appeared the Datsun 200B braked heavily, slewed across the footpath, taking two timber poles with it and came to rest wrapped around this fence, part of a bridge spanning a small creek. The fence penetrated right through the car after striking the driver's side on first impact. Miraculously, the victim was pushed across the interior into the back where a medical retrieval team administered plasma and painkillers to stabilise him. Around this life and death situation, the fireman worked, using a crane to stop the car from crashing into the creek below. Cutting gear and hydraulic jaws dismantled the wreck and the fence. An hour of frantic activity later, rescuers pulled him free. He was taken to Royal Adelaide Hospital with multiple injuries. He has a fractured pelvis, two broken legs, one of them bearing a severe gash. Doctors say he's in a serious but stable condition. When it skidded out of control and was wrapped around steel bridge posts and railings, the driver, an 18-year-old who recently moved from the Northern Territory, was trapped by the bridgework, his broken legs pinned in the front of the car and his body forced towards the back seat. A woman who held his hand until help arrived says he was conscious. He gave his name and address and talked to her calmly despite his pain. Police, firemen and ambulancemen worked intensely to free the man from the tangle using heavy cutting equipment and hoisting the car carefully away from the bridge. With his brother watching anxiously, the man was freed and ambulance men struggled to get him onto a stretcher and into a waiting ambulance. He was rushed to Royal Adelaide Hospital, reportedly...